Hi everyone, it's Miss Amy from Camden Public Library and uh, today is the last day of International Nature uh, Journaling Week, which has been so much fun for me. Um, and this is a great STEM activity. So this is kind of uh, about observation and we're going to do some printing. So what I've done is right before I went out and I collected a bunch of fun different leaves from all over um, outside in our amphitheater. Um, there's strawberry leaves and a fern and um, let's see there's um, this is uh, uh, I can't think of what it is. Maple leaf. Um, this is uh, some kind of viney thing. Uh, yeah, uh, this is a violet or Johnny Jump Up or whatever. Um, but so, and then I have a whole bunch of acrylic paint. And what I'm going to do, uh, this is a cool tree. I love this one. Um, what I'm going to do is I am going to use a uh, like sponge brush you can use a um, you could use a uh, why can't I think of it um, a cotton ball and uh, and a clothespin to like hold the cotton ball uh, or you you could just do it like this. Um, so I have um, I have some cardstock. I'm just gonna move move these over. Um, I picked them right before so that they don't wilt. Um, and um, I am painting right on the leaf uh, with the brush, getting a good amount on there. And then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go like that. And then I am going to use, I just happen to have a circle or a piece of paper or whatever, and rather than get my hands all dirty, um, I'm going to press down, I'm going to press down on the leaf with that and then lift it up. And you're going to see, uh, you're, you're going to test how, you're going to have to test and see like what is going to work the best. How much paint do you need? Uh, do you need to get it all over the whole thing? Uh, does it need, you know, things with more veins are going to print uh, easier? Um, so I'm going to print that. Okay. Let's see what that looks like now. Well, that one is a little clearer, but there's there's almost too much paint in the center of that one um, this time. Yeah, so I'm gonna try that one more time. And you can do different colors at the same time. Uh, so I'm just going to go like that. And I'm going to pick that up. And there, ooh, that's, so that's kind of looking really cool. And you can mix and match different colors. Um, I'm actually going to do, um, I'm going to do one. And I'm going to, I'm going to kind of mix and match some of the colors so that it gives me different Colors, and that's okay too. So I'm gonna put that right down. Same thing, I'm gonna print it. And then I can cut it up into different, mm -hmm. yeah, different. Uh, let's see if I do one more. If I print it again without doing the brush on there. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh. Ooh. That 
one's pretty. Okay, so I'm just gonna put that aside. Um, let's try, ooh, let's try, let's do the fern. Um, or let's do, let's do, let's do this. Okay, so this one, this one's kind of got a lot of texture to it. Um, so I'm gonna do a little bit of lots of color like this. going to give me a lot because there's a lot of paint on here. So let's see what happens here. I'm going to come down here with this one and I did the front of this. So let's see. Okay, and I'm going to move it. Yeah, see that one is not as good. Ooh, I like that one. I'm gonna move that one. I'm moving these to different spots. Ooh, I like that. I like it definitely with less paint on it. So that came out really, really cool. Um, I'm gonna put a little bit more paint on this and print it again like that okay yeah ooh I love it I think I'm gonna do this one this way I'm gonna do that one like that all right so you can see I'm printing it ooh like that very cool. Okay, so definitely that one, uh, I got some really cool stuff when I started moving it around. So I'm going to do that one again and see if, yeah, yeah, that one didn't, that one didn't come out as good as I had hoped. All right, let's try the violet. Um, let's do the backside. I like the back side of this. All right, so I'm going to put some different colors in here. Yep, this first one is going to be really tough because it's got a lot of ink. Way too much ink or way too much paint. Okay, so definitely finding out how much paint to use. So I'm, I'm going to do this first one and I know that I'm going to end up um, changing it or like moving, moving it. I'm going to move that out of the way. Okay. So I'm going to go here. I'm gonna put that one down. Pick it up. Move it. And each time I move it, ooh, ooh, I like that one. That's cool. Okay, so every time I move it, I get a different, I get a different, like, pattern. Because less of it or more of the leaf uh, kind of shows up. So really, really pretty. Um, I'm going to do a little bit more on here this last one okay i'm gonna put that on there oh i really really like this and then i can use these for different things i can use these patterns 
Oh, pretty. Wow. Okay, so definitely printing and moving it around in different colors. I love that. I hope you guys uh, try that um, and try some others. Um, I'm going to do just a couple more to see if I get some different patterns. Okay, I did the strawberry leaf and I hope you guys have fun and get out and enjoy this last day.